Dogs are everywhere here at the Olympic Park, but they are not working with security. This dog quickly made friends with some Olympic volunteers. We love dogs. He's, he's so cute. He's very so cute. cute, yes. And he can bite us. Oh my God, don't he, bite him. And he, he very big. <laughs> this dog doesn't have a home. He's a stray. Stray dogs in Sochi are actually fairly common. But city officials are doing everything they can to get rid of the dogs before they bite somebody or walk into an Olympic venue during competition. But getting rid of the dogs means killing them. It's a big task because there are thousands of strays running the streets of Sochi. Well, as an animal lover, for me that's sad. But if they're, you know, like um, stray cats, they can keep breeding and cause more problems. So I could see maybe why it's sad. But what do you do if you can't? control them. The local government hired an animal extermination company to capture and kill the stray dogs. Sochi animal activist Dina Filipova says 300 dogs a month are killed, mostly with poison. No, definitely. It is not humane. There is a humane way of solving the problem of stray dogs, which is used in Europe and the United States, and even in the countries of the former Soviet Union. That is a mass sterilization, which eventually leads to no stray dogs on the streets. The company in charge of killing the strays says it's been asked to increase its work during the Olympics. Mark Carlson, Associated Press, Sochi.